everybody, welcome to another Hell Hath Bird Reviews. This is your boy Deluxe with the Shattercast Uncut crew. And I know it's been a little while, but I didn't really, you know, have time to uh, do another video. So finally found time to do this. So um, today we have some G1 goodiness. Um, this is a shout out to uh, Lenny. He said I don't do enough Decepticons. So I thought, hey, why not do one of his favorites? So I'm doing G1 Galvatron today. Um, as you can see, he's in base mode right now. Or gun mode, whatever you want to call it. Um, he comes with two accessories, this little thing to hold his gun, or to his barrel, and he's got this gun which never used it in the cartoon, so I, I have no clue why they got this, but you know. Anyway, signal, you know, uh, plastic, uh, black and everything, no color on or anything, and that. Hold his barrel when he's in uh, robot mode. Anything? So he got this right here. Uh, Pretty cool, um, pretty good size. I mean, accurate to uh, the G1 cartoon and everything. Um, neat repro labels on this guy, really bad, but uh, that's what most G1s do, anyways. Um, he does have a, a, a gimmick, you know, where he fires and it makes noises. It goes doo doo doo, pew pew pew. You know, I think he's got three settings, I think, on there. Um, I don't have any batteries in there because don't want to get acid or anything in the moment, like that. Um, he uh, kind of rolls a little bit. He's got right here, right here. Um, Kind of rolls pretty good, it's okay. Uh, pretty good size right here. Um, other than that, you know, uh, I think whenever he uh, fires it lights up, so that's pretty cool. It's a pretty good gimmick, you know, he's a big, he's a good size for a G1. Um, good paint color and everything like that. Um, got all that like this. And he can put him in, you know, gun mode right here. And go pew pew pew, pew 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 pew. So, that's pretty cool. Um, anyway, so I'm gonna, uh, Reminded me that um, I was talking with my boy Oscar, and uh, he reminds me of a kind of a purple rain prince transformer like that. You know, it's got this purple on there. It looks pretty cool. You know, it's kind of lickable, and everything. So, um, anyways, well, I'm gonna do some size comparisons. Let's just bring in a uh, Mirage from uh, Alternators. So he's pretty good size, and we'll put a uh, C Dub Streaker over here. So. You know, he, he was pretty big for some reason, and uh, G1, they didn't really care about the size of anything, so they just made him big. Uh, Blaster uh, was bigger than the uh, Defensor and uh, uh, Devastator and all that stuff. It's kind of weird, but anyways, what can you do? It's the 80s. You gotta love it. Anyways, I'm gonna transform this guy. Um, hope you can see that. All right. First, I'm gonna take these right here. Put that back there. Purple brain, purple brain. That's my, that's my prince uh, thing. Purple brain, purple brain. Okay, take this up here, go like that. I'm gonna push him around like that. Open his arms, take his little gun, little goober thing out of his head. Pops out of his head, hey, how's everybody doing? Hope everybody can see that. Yep. I'm gonna take his arms out. See, he's a pretty big boy. Right here. Purple rain. Purple rain. Put the little barrel in here like that. Bam. And here you go. You have G1 Galvatron. He can also hold his weapon. Which I don't know why he has it, but oh well. Anyways, right there. Look at that. You see him good? Yeah, see like that. So see yeah. He's got some uh sticker issues, so but it's alright. Like I said, he, he does have the gimmick, you know, it would work, you know. And he does have settings. Yeah, he has three settings right back here. It's pretty cool. Um it's a good bot, you know, he's big. You know, bring in we'll bring in Starscream C Dove. So he's big as a later class, so he's actually bigger than Starscream. And I'll bring in old uh this is the uh 2007, I think, 2008, something like that, Encore issue. Uh, so it's a lot, lot, little light on purple, you know. Just, mm, it's a lickable. It's got the Matrix with him and everything. And he's a little clear, so he's got best stickers. He's red and all that stuff. But, so, so, yeah, he's a big he's a big guy uh, for uh, G1. Um, I should have should have brought over Cyclonus and Scourge, his little minions, so he could see what that was. So, anyways, so... I'm gonna go down, do a little uh, uh, floor time. So. Connection set up for me right here. 
start screen down up here like that. We got travel cross. We'll say, who interrupts my coordination? Coordination, star screen. This is bad comedy. Megatron, is that you? Oh, pew pew pew. Oh, I'm still later with the Decepticons. Ah, screw you, Galvatron. <laughs> Sorry. Anyways, uh, terrible on the voice acting. Sorry about that. Um, anyways, uh, I really like this guy. I've always liked Galvatron. Um, he's pretty cool. Uh, he went crazy during the series. Uh, like that. I'll give him, you know, at least nine and a half Hell Hasbro's. Because, you know, he's Galvatron. Can't wait for the new one from C Dub coming out. And the DX91 also to replace this one. Anyways, hope y'all liked it. Um, Hell Hasbro, and I will see y'all at TFCon uh, next weekend. And uh, come by and say hi to me. Hell Hasbro. Good night, folks.